Okay, here is a quick tutorial on how to do or how to make um, Virtual Sailor 7 mods in Roblox. So, here we have our ship. We are going to go to File, Advanced, Export this Object, to do whatever the fuck you want. Like for that, you need to have two programs to sketch up, by the way. SketchUp 8 and SketchUp 2017. SketchUp 2017 is for when you can get this extension called um, Universal Importer. It has a lot of file types that you can import. And you need SketchUp 8 to get this um, add-on to export uh, or plugin to export DirectX files. So let's go to SketchUp 2017 first. Import with the Universal Importer. Now, just go on that. Just oh, now, I'm glad that actually came up. There's a way to fix it. Grab the whole model, group it, then just export it again. Hopefully, you can hear me. Make out what I'm saying. Um, let's try that again. Let's see if this works. <laughs> Come on. Well, I already did one, so let's just let's just do this one. But hey, you get the idea of it and everything. Don't worry, it's gonna freeze a lot. There's your base plate. I would recommend deleting the base plate in Roblox ahead of time, but. There's your Roblox model. Now, I'm gonna export that as a 3D model. I'm gonna call it a... And just name whatever you want. Now, that... Get out of SketchUp 2017 and go to SketchUp 8. You import your model, and you wanna size it up. You'll figure out, you'll, you'll find out how to size it, and try to get in, the, try, try to get it in the center, try to get this line right here, and then after that, with your direct X, uh, plugin, do export model, and where your stuff is laid out, you just go to boat, and do, do your .x file, you just replace it, and... It will do its job. Wait for it, it's gonna freeze a little bit. Wouldn't that be funny if I wasn't recording the whole time? But, look. Now, Let's go to Virtual Sailor. Bada boom, bada boom. There you go. Dreams have come true. Thanks for watching. That's all. Bad.